Hi Big Tractor Power fans, in this video I would like to share with you different Farmall tractors producing 14 by 18 square bales. These tractors are working with balers that are putting the bales up in different ways. We'll see a bale accumulator, we'll see bales being hand stacked on a wagon directly from the square baler, as well as a kick baler actually ejecting the bales into a wagon. And then we'll also see a quarter turn baler dropping the bales on the field and being picked up by an automatic bale wagon. I hope that you'll enjoy seeing and hearing all these red farmal tractors producing square bales. And now let's head out to the field to take in all the baling action. Here we can see an international Farmal 826 Hydro tractor rated at 84 PTO horsepower. This machine was manufactured from 1969 through 1971. It's producing 14 by 18 bales of straw with a Heston by Massey Ferguson 1840 baler equipped with a Holsher bale accumulator. This accumulator collects 10 square bales and deposits them in a group in the field to be picked up and hauled back to the farm for storage. Here we can see the picking up process for accumulated bales. A skid steer loader with a bale grapple will come up and collect the bales and then place them on a wagon for transport out of the field. This 113 PTO horsepower International Farmal 1256 tractor that was manufactured from 1967 through 1969 is producing 14 by 18 bales of wheat straw with an international 430 square baler. This baler is set up in a very traditional way that was common back in the 1970s. We can see the bales are produced and then pushed up a chute onto a flat deck wagon and manually stacked.
farms looking to speed up production and save labor while producing 14 by 18 bales will often equip their baler with a kicker or thrower. Here we can see a 145 PTO horsepower International Farmal 1466 tractor that was produced from 1971 through 1976. This tractor is powering an International 445 square baler that's equipped with a 15 bell thrower. This international thrower is equipped with two sets of rollers that will eject the square bale directly into the wagon in tow. Collecting square bales on a wagon involves quite a bit of labor, whether they are manually stacked in the field off the chute of the baler or a kick baler is used to pile them in a wagon. Back at the farm, those wagons have to be hand unloaded. Here we can see the bales produced by the International 445 baler and 15 thrower. The bales are moved from the wagon onto a bale elevator, which conveys them up into the barn where they are stacked in the mow by hand. Farms that produce a great number of 14 by 18 square bales will drop them directly on the field and collect them with an automatic bale wagon. Here we can see a 96 PTO horsepower Case IH Farmal 120A tractor manufactured from 2012 through 2017 powering a New Holland BC 5070 baler. This baler takes its 14 by 18 bales and uses a quarter turn to drop them directly on the field for easy pickup by the automatic bail wagon. This 173 horsepower New Holland H9870 stack cruiser can automatically pick up 161 14 by 18 square bales left in the field by the baler. This operation moves along swiftly and in a matter of minutes the bales are collected in a neat stack and headed back to the farm.
I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field with these Farmall tractors producing 14 by 18 square bales. It's always interesting to see the variety of ways that bales can be produced. And I'd like to hear about your farming operation. Do you produce 14 by 18 square bales and how do you put them up? Does your farm rely on Farmall tractors from International or Case IH? I'd like to hear about it all in the comments section below this video. And if you've enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. As always, thank you for watching.